Hi everyone, Amy Love here, and I'm just coming on today to share with you this um, altered composition notebook I created uh, using um, the beautiful laces and embellishments from Angel Dream Crafts Kim on Etsy, and I will put a link to her shop below. And the paper that I used is Prima Aveca Mora, I think is what it's called. Of course, I can't find it now. I've got paper strewn across the place, but yes, it's the that paper pad and some of the tags and things from um, that same line. I just think it's gorgeous, and I have just had it in my um, paper stash forever, and I thought, yeah, I really want to play with it. So that is the paper I used, and isn't it gorgeous? Look at it. It's got like some gold foil. Just absolutely beautiful. So I covered the comp notebook with this uh, paper front and back. Um, I did use lace and fabric for the binding and then I just put this beautiful trim from Angel Dream Crafts along the edge. I love this so much. Pretty pretty. And along the bottom I put a layer of the pink pleated tool trim and then the like turquoise uh, pleated tool trim or robin's egg blue i'm not sure what color you want to call that but i know they go so cute together and so well with this paper pad it's so stinking cute so i just layered some lace and some cheesecloth behind this image from the paper pad and then i just sewed them together and then i put them um, down but i did add some sorry silk from kim's store for the closure and then I put um, little flower punch outs from the paper pad kit um, covering the edges of that. And then I put this on top and I just love the sweet little bird image. It's just so cute. And then I put this beautiful trim from Kim's shop um, going down the side. And then I hung a charm on a gold bulb pen and you can get bulb pens at Angel Dream Crafts. And I put one of the punch outs from the ephemera from the paper and then one of my shabby little um, charms that I created. They're just so cute. And I actually used tool from the pleated tool trim from Angel Dream Crafts to make those. They're just so, so sweet. So that's the outside. I just love how it turned out. But let me show you the inside. So I covered the inside and back cover with this shiny pink paper that I've had in my stash in forever. And I created pockets using the same um, paper pad from Prima. It's so cute. And then in this one, I put uh, this little insert. Isn't it cute? And of course the bow is from Angel Dream Crafts. I also, um, layered some lace behind this and sewed it together just like I did on the front. And I used uh, another one of the bird um, punch outs from the paper kit. So cute. And so inside, I made a pocket with this beautiful lace from Kim's store. I just love this lace. Isn't it pretty? And I didn't want it hanging down below because I knew I'd be sticking it in here. So I just brought it up to the edge and then sewed along the top uh, to make the pocket. Super cute. And so here is another punch out from the um, ephemera kit. And then I made a little tag that just tucks right in there. Isn't that sweet? The tags are so cute in this paper pad. it's They're just adorable. So that tucks right in there. And then this is just another um, cutout from the paper pad, it's upside down. It's so pretty. This paper pad is just gorgeous. So excited I got a chance to play with it. So in here I just put a little, um, I used some scrap paper and made a little notepad and put some of the ephemera. And this is from the same paper pad. And then up here, I just made a little hidden paper clip. And that's what the front side looks like. And that's what the back looks like. It's so cute. I love it. So I put everything back together. And it just sticks right in this pocket. So cute. I like it coming out a little bit though. And then over here, I made another little paper clip. Um, 
sorry about my camera angle but there's um, the back and these are just made out of tickets from the ephemera kit for from the paper pad and then here's the back covered with the same pink paper and then I just I got the tag kit um, that came with the paper pad so I didn't um, embellish them I just think they're cute I did ink the edges and then I put this adorable little lace on each one but they're just so cute so I thought whoever uh, gets this uh, notebook they could decorate these if they wanted to or just use them um, however they want they're so sweet and so I left all the pages in the middle blank so somebody could use it however they want to or decorate the pages if they want to. I had such fun creating this. I spent the day crafting and um, such a good time because it's just such a pretty, <laughs> pretty color palette and I love it and it goes so well with the beautiful laces and trims from Angel Dream Crafts. So um, I'd love to know what you think. Please leave me a comment and a thumbs up and this will be available in my Etsy and you can find a link to my Etsy store and to Kim's Etsy store below in the description box. I hope you're all doing well and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye everybody.